here. Um, we got our mushrooms here. We need to take a couple of these. Mm -hmm. You could got any muscle? You want <laughs> you, you really muscle, man? <laughs> you, want me to, you want me to get it for you? But the secret with these things, right? You just... Oh! Right, yeah. There you go. New trick! Oh, you just gotta, just gotta knock it. That's mm -hmm. your thing. So we can take I a think you're cheating though. Oh yeah, how you cheating? You're an executive chef somewhere? No, 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 executive chef. You, you know just like mean? to eat. I just love food and um, I love to experiment with food. Because mm -hmm. I realize all foods link to each other. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When you start doing Asian, um, Chinese and stuff like that and Italian, mm -hmm. everything tends to use the same ingredients but how very, very, it? very mm -hmm. in different ways. Like yeah. for example, if you're doing Asia, you would use um, vegetable right. oil mm -hmm. when you stir fried. But with Italian, Fives. you use um, um, olive, olive oil. oil. So yeah. there's a slight difference, but the things that you see onion, you see garlic, True. and see peppers and everything. I never thought about it like that. You know, and um, if you're doing um, what do we call it now the Asian um, Thai, mm -hmm. you use sesame seed oil. Yeah. That's right. That's that true. nutty kind yeah. of flavor. Correct. So yeah. it's, it's just different oils and different things that makes the food taste slightly different. Mm -hmm. So what's the strangest dish you've ever eaten? The strangest dish I've ever eaten? Mountain chicken. When I was in London. That's frog, right? Frog legs. <laughs> <laughs> So you got our vegetables there. So right now we'll be putting on the pasta right now. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we got our pasta right here. Right. So you can put in this here. Right What's here. it, linguini? No, linguini. Now the thing is, a lot of people like to slurp the pasta. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, I find it tastes people like, people like, 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 like it long slurpy. and slurpy. Yeah. But you got, no, I, so what you do, I kind of break my pasta. Oh, okay. So I break, I, I, break, I break my pasta yes, uh -huh. in two. Mm -hmm. In two. Right. Okay. So most of the time, what the Italians do, what they do, they take it and stir it in like that, mm -hmm. and just release it. Oh, so it gets soft. So it gets soft first, mm -hmm. and just release it and release it on one part. Okay. But I don't have all that time. You just... <laughs> okay, you're working, I, I, man. I'm working, man. I got all that time, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay. So we got the salt, we're gonna put some salt in there. Uh -huh. Yeah. Need any pepper? So no, this is the first time I've ever used this salt here. Oh, okay. you do. Doing well, though. <laughs> You need any black pepper? Um, we do really need the black pepper at the end. At the end, okay. Yeah, we okay. put some black pepper on it. Good stuff. So we use the salt here for flavor. Mm -hmm. There you go. So our pasta there is cooking. All right, okay. So I love chicken. Mm -hmm. Everybody in Barbara says, there's a chicken show. Mm -hmm. right, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Chicken rules. Chicken rules. So chicken. I remember a time I wanted to bake a chicken. Mm -hmm. Went into the supermarket, bought this lovely chicken. Mm -hmm. Really well priced and everything. So I'm, I'm going back to buy the chicken mm -hmm. and I saw a baked chicken, uh -huh. raw chicken, ready done chicken. Finished already. Finished already. Mm -hmm. So you know, that made my job a lot easier <laughs> the same day. <laughs> it's the same, same, same price, same price and everything. <laughs> so what happens, I, I, I bought that chicken and what I do, I, knew, I, uh, I made a really nice salad. Mm -hmm. I love salads as well. Mm -hmm. right. And it's arugula, watermelon, oh. arugula. Oh. Watermelon, arugula. Oh. He's really my language. With feta like, cheese. Oh, she's speaking my language. Yeah, it's not with... Oh. with uh, <laughs> <laughs> this commercial break is brought to you by Cadbury, the chocolate, the choice. A beautiful selection of indoor and outdoor furniture. Unique home accessories and gifts. Gorgeous bed and bath products. Largest kitchen store on the island. Outstanding service with a smile seven days a week. An exciting wedding registry. So we're back here now, so we definitely the pan is heating up. Mm -hmm. You got it here now. So we've already got the oil, put a little oil in the pan, just like that. Let's cover the bottom. Cover the bottom, stuff like that. You don't want too much oil. Mm -hmm. You don't want it greasy or nothing like that. So you just stir it around the pan. So you got that there. So you start adding your vegetables and stuff like okay. that. Okay. 
So you come over here. So what I like to do first, I like to add in the onion and the garlic first and get that nice and fried up and smelling good in the kitchen. Mm -hmm. Cause you smell it, you're doing something. I remember, <laughs> I remember the old people saying, you know, you can't cook. Just fry some onion and garlic. <laughs> it smells people like think something and people happening. think something happening. You know, they're thinking something happening, but really, truly, they ain't really happening at all, at all, at all. <laughs> Should we stir that up like that? Mm -hmm. So you just sweat these out a little bit. Yeah, sweat these out a little bit. Like, let like my boy trans. 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 We start up in the end nice like that. It smells like it is something. It's not what I'm saying, it's just for a little, <laughs> little garlic and onion smell like something happening. It works. It works. So if you want to know, you want to put the tenders here now. So you want to get the tenders all, okay. all nice and, and done up like that. Mm -hmm. Nice. So you added salt already or? So you don't, you don't really add nothing yet. When mm -hmm. everything starts to go together, then you start putting oh, the ingredients okay. one by one and yeah. stuff like that. So yeah, onion, chicken. So what, what you can see now, your chicken is actually going to start to turn white. Mm -hmm. yeah. Just like that. Yeah. So you just want the outside to turn nice and white, all the chicken, mm -hmm. all the things. So you just keep stirring it. Smells like something happening here. Yeah, something happening here. Something, something happening here. Yeah. You have a phone call, something happening. <laughs> that would be RPD. Not he, not he. <laughs> something happening. <laughs> mm -hmm. So I actually got a regular song called Tell Me What You're Looking For and stuff like that. I want to hear it. Tell me what you're looking for. Is it in a place or time? Tell me why I can't go. Isn't where you lost your home? Tell me what you're looking for. Don't look at me when you sing it. Don't do it. Don't Sorry. do it. My bad. My bad. Smells <laughs> so good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the chicken looking nice and white there like that. The pasta is okay. The pasta, but I gotta definitely check the pasta. I was just thinking about that there. You can check the pasta right now. I don't want you to overcook your pasta. Definitely, definitely don't want to overcook my pasta. Ah, so the pasta here looking nice. She boiling nice. She boiling nice. Ah, uh, look at that. Look. She boiling up there really nice. So you, guys, you can start out there for me. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. You guys are help, man. Maybe you can find John. John just looking pretty in the kitchen. Oh, no. <laughs> nice, nice, pretty. John's supposed to be telling me my fill up. You know what you should do? You should do this and do that, you know? <laughs> John, <laughs> John drinking. <laughs> you're like so accomplished. Yeah. The only thing I would say is when you add your pasta, uh -huh. as I said earlier, you should really agitate your water. Mm -hmm. So as you add your pasta to your water initially, uh -huh. stir it. One time. One time. Mm -hmm. Okay. It, it doesn't stick together. Oh. But if you just put it in there and leave it. I leave it, it will stick together. Oh. But, but John, tell me that. Yeah. <laughs> tell me these things, John. <laughs> Don't let me stumble, John. <laughs> so we chicken looking really nice yeah. right there. So we can add veg in vegetables there for me, Charlene. Okay. Yeah. The mushrooms great. and the pepper? Everything, right now, everything. Great. Just add everything right there now. Working my, working my pasta. Mm-hmm. So I like to find out, I like to taste my pasta too. Like, find out yeah. if, it's, if it's... If it's al dente. If it's al dente and stuff like that. So we get, get a nice little piece here. So I like to... I know it's, for some most people it'd be hot, but... Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? Just give you. <laughs> and, it, and it's really good there. Yeah, you can definitely work with that there. Yeah, you can. You can definitely work with that. Yeah, you can. So you have to take that out of the so we can, heat now. So we can, we can definitely turn off the stove. Which one is it? Uh, this one right here. This one here, we turn that off. Uh huh. That's good. That's good. So we can still leave it in there a little bit because it's still, you know, the, okay. But yeah. the, like you said, it still cooks and stuff like that. Carry over cooking. Correct. Mm -hmm. Carry over yeah. Cooking. So you got our vegetables in there now. Mm -hmm. Correct. Take over? Nice. So now we have our cream. Okay. Yeah. So you can take cream here now. So okay. We got our cream. Very nice. Ooh. Correct. So your chicken just boiling. If you have more cream, I have some more cream in the fridge as well. Okay, love it. Need more. Go ahead. So we stir that up in here. So what happens? You have to let this here now thicken up a little bit. Mm -hmm. So while you're doing that now, what I like to add. Pineapple. Oh, so pineapple. the pineapple has that nice mm -hmm. sweet flavor to it. Okay, well. excellent. This is something different though, right? Yeah. Do you usually put pineapple on Alfredo? I don't, but okay. it's always a, a first. It's nice. Right. And those are good for eating too. I thought to say we can do that last piece. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice, nice. So you put in, put in this last piece here. Uh -huh. okay. Sorry, Shirley. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Robot crew. Robot, right through. Right through, man. Looking good, smelling good. Thank you very much. The so food, no, it's the food, not you. The food. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> oh, right, I thought I was going to make perfume this morning. Yeah. <laughs> There's something really nice. One million, you know? <laughs> so we got that now, so we can add some salt. Okay, yeah. now we put in salt. Now we put in the salt and stuff like that. Can you go the other way? Is the other way? Oh, there yes. you go. Yeah. I'll start when you put it in. Put in the salt there. 
So now we got some black pepper, some black pepper. Yeah, right there, yeah. right there, yeah. That looking good. Mm -hmm. So, one love about the show, mm -hmm. if it doesn't taste good, like, please. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but everything else tastes good. Everything, 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 everything tastes good, good, you know what I'm saying? We yeah, haven't yeah. had a bad, a bad meal. Well, this no, we haven't. We haven't. We haven't. All, everything has so been no quite pressure. good. So, no pressure. No pressure. Really, 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 after he's cooking, after tasting that lovely soup. <laughs> so, tons of pressure, come on. Yeah. I'm so, sure. we just have to let good. this boil out. So, this boil is sticking out. It's looking quite good, actually. Correct, correct. So, we can put a little taste test there. Mm. That's good. That's good. Tasting really nice there. Okay. Mm. We can let this boil up some more. Mm -hmm. We can hit a quick commercial break. Correct. And be back Correct. You know, right after this. Okay. Egonomics. It is obviously that we've taken the essence of the cola nut and put it in a liquid form inside a bottle. The cola nut gives you energy and stamina. I think the main benefit uh, from drinking Clayton's is that you've got the choice as to whether you make it into an alcoholic product.